it's an honor to be a part of this grand uh, mega finale and uh, our brand is committed to uh, making you all the moment of tomorrow for India and uh, the vision that Sunil sir has with attached with this brand is uh, that obviously it's going to be a great contribution in grooming in the kind of investments uh, that go with the best trainers in grooming uh, all of y'all to actually refine all of those assets and abilities that you'll already have to make y'all the future of the country because uh, India is heading towards a new generation, a new time where women empowerment is the key subject and the key uh, uh, issue that is being discussed and um, we are heading today to Thailand for the grand finale and I am so excited and so looking forward to be a part of this whole beauty pageant. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, Ms. Ajna Kochu, ma'am, can I have your words from you, please, too? A very good evening to everyone here. Um, today, when I sit here, I reflect on, um, you know, an evening 2010 when Mr. Rane had come to my shop and uh, we um, conceived this whole idea of having a beauty pageant uh, which was unbiased and uh, which would uh, groom um, Indian beautiful um, young teenage or, and you know girls around 20 um, and we conceived the whole uh, show and then we had the first show and from there to here I think um, it's commendable though um, the entire event has uh, evolved so much um, and I see so much of improvement in it it's a pleasure to be here uh, with it um, I feel a um, kind of uh, connection with this because I was there, we were actually sitting down and saying okay we'll do an event like this and we'll have this many rounds and this is how we make it different and this is how it will be unbiased and this is how the girls will get a chance and today when I saw all of y'all at my store trying out the garments, um, it was so beautiful, um, it was really nice. Um, also, I see so much potential in some of the girls who are here. Um, I, I actually see uh, the future Bollywood faces in some of them here. So today when they were trying the beautiful khagras and uh, strutting around, um, I thought, um, you know, it was a pleasure. And the amount of energy all of you have is commendable. Um, and uh, looking forward to the show in, uh, uh, to the grand finale um, in Bangkok. Um, and I must uh, compliment Mr. Rane um, on the way his vision is so different. Um, from uh, the vision of uh, many other events that happen, pageants that happen. He doesn't cut corners, uh, he, doesn't, um, he doesn't get faltered by problems that come up. So, um, you know, the, uh, I think all of you are so lucky that you all are being uh, taken to an international country and um, the finale is not just finale, it's a world finale where um, he has uh, made sure that the television channels worldwide are going to telecast this finale of yours. Um, so I think that's different. Also the way uh, this entire training program of yours is being conducted is amazing. It is, um, it's without cutting corners, it's giving you all the best. So it's a great opportunity girls uh, to be a part of this and, um, and I, I'm so happy to be a part of this again and uh, look forward to dressing you all up and thank you so much all the media people for being here. Thank you so much. Thank you so much ma'am. Can I have a quick point from the chairman of the Air Shuttle Group, Mr. With this uh, brand, it's a proud moment for me to be here. <laughs> now I leave to you. <laughs> well, thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you for this question. I would like And that is what I can see, Mr. Rane and Ramon and the teams meticulously, they selected the best from all of us, which is really nice. We are handling, Stadi Bajanak is doing the three, uh, three looks for the beauty contestants. We've done the two travel rounds. Again, keeping glamour and style in mind. The first look is of a beige silk shirt teamed with a black waistcoat. The second is a chicken casual look. To be comfortable, yes, look the gorgeous you, which is a printed blazer teamed with a, a printed shirt teamed with a violet blazer. And the finale round wherein we wanted the girls to look, to enhance their beauty, to make them look as feminine and bring out the best in them, which is a use of gold and soft pinks. And kudos to Mr. Rane and Ramon to be able to put all this together and looking forward to the associations and to something which helps women on empowerment year on year. Congratulations in advance. Thank you so much, Mark.
2014. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, <laughs> Yes. Yes, I have learned in railways. Um, I just want to thank uh, Rani Sir because he has given me this opportunity to be part of the IP team this year. Uh, last year it was for me an amazing year because I have grown myself really well. Um, I've been an independent strong woman and yes, I have seen women empowerment over the rest of the world. I have traveled a lot and spread it. So I hope that I can learn you a lot. I think I already did a little bit, because we are not there. So there is a lot to do. So we will start from tomorrow in Thailand. Uh, I hope you all will enjoy. Thank you so much. Yes, thank, you. thank you, Shika. A very good evening to everyone present here. And first of all, congratulations to all the contestants for uh, being top 27 uh, beauties of India. And uh, this time the competition is really tough because uh, we have then most Indian princess and Indian princess international together. So we have girls from uh, different countries from all over the world. I welcome you to India and to the Indian princess family. And uh, I wish you all the luck and success. And uh, I owe everything to Mr. Sinyurani and Mrs. Varsharani and to Indian princess because this recognition, this name is all because of Indian princess. I'm here because of the Indian Princess. So I expect the same from your girls. The gratitude and the courtesy should be there. And wish you all the luck and success. Work hard. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ali. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. How are we? Very good. Well, I'm the Vice President of uh, Indian Princess and in Princess International, but this time I'm joining y'all a little late. I had had this pleasure of training uh, the contestants of Indian Princess and Indian Princess International uh, last four years. And uh, to begin with, uh, let me just congratulate everyone, especially uh, Mr. Sunil Rani, for successfully beginning this uh, season six of our unique beauty pageant. And congratulations to all you contestants. Y'all are gorgeous, beautiful, and smiling. I'm so happy to see y'all. And congratulations to all the team workers here, the team members. I'm so glad to see y'all here. The same, some of, some of the faces are new, some of the faces are old. And I'm very, uh, it's a pleasure to meet all the panelists here. Ms. Ramon Lamba, thank you so much for being with us uh, with, uh, for this season six. Uh, Ms. Aarti Mehra, it was nice meeting you. Thanks for joining us for this season. Again, Shika uh, Birla, Ms. Shika Birla, thank you so much. And of course, Archana Kochar, as uh, not had uh, the pleasure of meeting her earlier, but I've, you were there with us in 2010 at JW. I remember your clothes very much till now, and they were astounding. And let me congratulate you on this uh, award that you got in Canada. It's commendable to get this <laughs> award abroad. And uh, I'm saying this because this is a platform for women empowerment and somehow people are scared of women's beauty you know and here we are teaching these little girls these young girls to be confident of themselves and not to be ashamed of their sexuality their body their talent their beauty their intelligence just go out and shine girls and show what you made of them and that's what I wish you all, be, all the best for the future, uh, for the further journey. And let this journey be of uh, self-discovery, not just the uh, beauty, but and uh, a piece of advice. I don't mean to preach anything, but don't. Uh, what I would uh, expect you all is uh, not to look at 
or compare yourself with each other because each one is beautiful in their own way. You might like somebody's hair, you might like somebody's eyes, you might like somebody's skin, but you don't know who's admiring you for what you have there. Maybe the way you speak, maybe the way you have those sexy hips, the, the way you move them. And just be yourself and show the world what you made up of. This beauty pageant is not just about the beauty. It's also, uh, it's also attached to the uh, two social causes. I'm very proud to uh, always say this. Uh, it's attached to world education girl child education and uh, supporting the war widows and I've been uh, traveling uh, extensively with some of the contestants for past two three years in all the remote villages from all the way from Jammu Kashmir to down south to Kerala and let me tell you girls I don't know whether you've uh, been told or I don't know whether the press is aware of this we were the first organization to reach some of the remote places in Jammu and Kashmir. And that's what some of the people, some of the people told us that no one ever, ever, ever bothers to come there. And I'm so proud to uh, be a part of the social cause because of this. My friends, <laughs> and especially Lipika Varma sitting over there. <laughs> and all other uh, dignitaries from the press as you have supported right up to Mathura and uh, Mr. Shukla organizing this press because I know Bombay Velvet party is there still you guys are here hats off to you because it is very important I remember Archana must be remembering 2010 9th March 2010 when we did finale 9th March is the birthday of Shah Rukh Khan and all the press because of their friendship with me and my friendship with them they were not ready to go to his bungalow. you remember that and 2000, 2000 the birthday 9th ko tha yaad hoga from Taj Lands Inn they were doing party at his bungalow and literally his people were trying to pull people I am thankful to all of you. Second, congratulations to all the contestants that you have come up to this particular level. All my team members, especially the Vice President, Mrs. Varsha Rane, Mrs. Ramon Lamba, CEO of Indian Princess, Archana Kocher being the fashion designer and our board of advisory for the Athar of Fashion and Arts, Arti Mehra and Mr. Manoj Mehra sitting in the corner. I have seen you, Manoj. This uh, couple have done excellently well for making the designs for the girls, their costumes, staying in Delhi has a tremendous name but still they want to be associated with Indian princes because of the nurturing the young talent of India. Chandni Sharma being the winner last year, Nadeen Makanlal winner Indian princess international 2014. Whenever I say this, these two girls always say sir please say 2014 forever. <laughs> Then we have Shikha Birla Chairman, Air Shagun Group. They have supported us as a travel partner as she had announced the winner will go to Malaysia and Singapore. Hopefully she will be back also. <laughs> then we have all the team members of Indian Princess, especially thanks to Shefali Parak. They know that she went all over places to find all of you. Her assistant Roslyn. Then uh, Elimination expert Malik. <laughs> then we have Dr. Nimade. Very important, there is one girl, you might have met her or you have not seen her. She is working continuously in Bangkok with the Thai government. Yes, sir. Is Jinia Batra, yes, sir. who had appeared for IS examination and soon she will become a collector. Wow. But still she is working with us because her joining is in month of August. So she is handling an entire event in Bangkok with the government of Thailand tourism ministry. One of my friend who is very influential in Thailand because of the government is 50% military, 50% politics. It has been appointed by the president of Thailand, which is Satish Saigal. Then we have a choreographer. There is no smile on the face.
Mr. Benal. You know, I told Benal all the time, you should try to under understand the noise of the clappings. In the political area, now the noise means clapping, means you'll have to end up your speech. <laughs> then we have another lady who is there with us since the last so many years, which I have seen her transformation also. Means I have seen the younger generation's transformation when they come with Indian princes, but I have seen a lady who is a doctor, is converting herself into the glamour world. <laughs> If you see Dr. Prajita's photo of 2011, and you see now, where is she? And you see Dr. Prajita, this is all my team, means they work excellently well. Day and night, means she remembers the stories of the contestant and how she had made them work and walk fantastically, excellently well. Then we have Casey, being one of the renowned choreographers. Then we have the designers, stylist Preeti and Jasreet, Nesna Jekar, Dr. Varun, Shikha Gupta being one of the team members, and very important one lady, constantly give a big round of applause. Without her, the team will not go anywhere. Audrey De Salva from Mumbai. Anushka Kamta from Suriname. Neha Vishwakarma from Delhi. from Delhi. Chandigarh Bhavna Makija from Ahmedabad Shaista Marian from Netherlands Mumbai Parul Sharma from Mumbai Himani Sharma from Delhi from Mumbai Sakshi Gupta from Delhi Steffi Patel from Delhi
Roseanne Ganesan from South Africa. Angel Goel from Shimla. Sukanya Bhattacharya from Mumbai. Amanpreet Karnawal from Rajasthan. Simran Mahindruwal from Delhi. Sneha Priya Roy from Mumbai. And Rashi Yadav from Delhi. So, जो costumes मैंने इस time बनाए हैं इनके round के लिए वो sarees हैं लेकिन अलग type की sarees हैं so it's a lehenga meets a saree तो आधी saree आधा lehenga है they very unique it's like a lehenga marries a saree and that's the costumes that they're going to be wearing in short में ये journey जो अभी 2010 से चालू हुई आपके साथ कितना evolve हुआ और कितना different है इस बार बहुत evolve हुआ है और main चीज life में जो होती है वो evolve करना ही होती है क्योंकि जब हम शुरू करते हैं तो हम सब छोटे से ही शुरू करते हैं तो जो बहुत अच्छी बात है इस इवेंट में वो है कि हर साल वो इवॉल्व हुए हैं और अभी एक बहुत अच्छे मुकाम पे पहुंच गए हैं एंड आई होप वन डे दे विल बी वन ऑफ द मोस्ट लीडिंग इवेंट्स ऑफ इन दिस कंटेक्स्ट इन आर कंट्री थैंक यू न्यू लास्ट मी क्वेश्चन Start to look there or there? Look there. Okay. Rolling. Keep your ears clean to me and your sight clean to me. Okay. Be a little bit loud. Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. Rolling. Rolling. How does it feel? One year with the Indian princess has the Indian princess in the crown resting on your head. What is the feeling like? Share the entire euphoria with us. Um, it, it feels great to wear this crown. You can ask these girls all admiring this crown. And but with this crown comes lot of lot of responsibilities, which I think I have uh, somehow reached up to their expectations, uh, the teen expectations. And uh, I won't say that I'm Indian Princess 2014 only. It's like my family, and there with Indian Princess always. Uh, you'll be parting with the crown, unfortunately, this time around. So uh, possessive. Uh, <laughs> uh, well, the moment of crowning will be very, uh, I won't lie, it will be very nostalgic for me. Mixed emotions will be there. One, uh, it, it's a proud moment that uh, Indian princess is going to a next level altogether. And second, that uh, I won't be wearing this crown publicly after that. So, but in, this is the part of life and uh, this has to go on and I wish all the success to my successor. I hope she takes it with uh, pride and she makes us proud. Uh, personally, how has your life changed after wearing this crown? Well, you can see yourself. It was not like this before. Uh, since I have won this crown uh, in, entirely, it's all different. At my home place also, everyone comes to my place and they get their pictures clicked with me. Um, as I said, it has come with lots of responsibilities. So. I always give priority to Indian princess, whether it's my personal work or uh, work related to films or something, any offers coming up to me, I always give priority to, to Indian princess. So, Has Bollywood come calling yet? Um, not exactly, but yeah, two scripts were offered to me, but I, I didn't like them so much, so but, yeah. But are you entering the film industry today? I mean, are you going yeah, I've already sound, uh, tel, uh, signed Telugu. Okay. So, yeah, I, I'll be shooting for Telugu movie after, as soon as the passion gets over. Okay, wish you all the very best. Thank you so much.